I'm working on a new project today that I've been dying to do since we purchased our house a year ago, and that is turning this gold framing on the fireplace into a more modern black finish. We eventually will redo our whole fireplace area. As you can see, we already ripped out some of the tile down here and also the tile on the hearth. But for the purpose of this video, we're just going to be focusing on the gold framing of the fireplace and how this Rust-Oleum High Heat Ultra Finish does with turning that outdated gold finish into a more modern black finish. So our first step is going to be the prep work. We're going to want to open windows, doors, i um, going to wear a mask while I'm spray painting so I don't breathe in too much of the fumes. Um, also we're going to lightly sand with about 120 grit sandpaper the framing that we're going to spray paint and then wipe it down with soap and water. ready to go in and tape it off. opened up my doors and windows, putting the dogs outside. I'm gonna put my mask on, so now um, hold the can upright uh, 12 to 16 inch inches from the surface and spray steadily in a back and forth motion. tape covered and protected the grout so well other than these spots which was just my mistake for not um, taping it perfectly but otherwise I am so happy with the results. 
All right, the project is complete and I am so excited. This looks so good. It just looks like a completely different fireplace and all we did was spray paint the gold, which was super outdated and then um, just gave it this nice new black finish. So I used frog tape for taping around the tile, the grout, and also on the glass um, before I put on the, um, the newspaper on top. But this worked out great as you saw with the grout lines. It stuck so good to that so I did not mess up my grout at all. And then I did get some spray paint on the glass itself and that was really easy to get off. I used Goo Gone and that worked really well. Um, for glass, I also used it on the tile a little bit. I know I said it in my last video when we painted our kitchen countertops, but I'm saying it again that this project was super easy and I highly recommend it. It was only $4 and it took um, a couple hours and most of that was just prep time, taping everything off. Um, making sure I didn't get any spray paint where I didn't want it to, but this was such an easy project and for $4 you can't beat that on updating some outdated gold hardware that you don't want to look at anymore. So I definitely recommend this project and I hope that you're able to find this video useful so that you can use it on your own home projects and if you do, please um, comment below how it turns out. And if you wouldn't mind liking this video and subscribing to my channel, thank you so much. Also feel free to comment if there's any DIY or home projects you'd like to see in the future for me to do and I'd be more than happy to check them out. So thank you so much. I hope this video helps you.